You have likely encountered both names, grizzly bear and brown bear, and perhaps even assumed they were distinct species. However, are they truly different, or is it merely a naming error? These formidable predators reign supreme in the wilderness, yet distinguishing between them is not as straightforward as it appears. Today, we embark on an expedition into the wild to conclusively resolve this debate. By the conclusion of this video, you will possess the knowledge necessary to accurately identify a grizzly bear from a brown bear through the examination of physical characteristics, behavioral patterns, and habitat preferences. Let us commence this exploration. Both grizzly bears and coastal brown bears belong to the same species, Ursus arctos, the brown bear. The term grizzly specifically refers to a subspecies, Ursus arctos horribilis, that inhabits inland regions. Coastal brown bears, on the other hand, are typically referred to simply as brown bears. Thus, technically, all grizzlies are brown bears, but not all brown bears are grizzlies. One of the most significant distinctions lies in size. Coastal brown bears are exceptionally large, owing to their abundant salmon diet. Adult males can weigh between 900 to 1,400 pounds, with some individuals exceeding this range. Grizzlies, residing inland with more limited food sources, are smaller, typically ranging from 400 to 790 pounds for adult males. In terms of height, coastal brown bears can stand up to 9 feet tall on their hind legs, with exceptionally large individuals potentially reaching up to 10 or even 11 feet. Grizzly bears, when standing on their hind legs, can reach a height of 7 to 8 feet. Some large males, particularly coastal grizzlies, can be even taller, potentially reaching 9.8 feet. Grizzlies possess a distinct muscular hump on their shoulders. This powerful mass serves as a tool for digging and contributes to their iconic hunched profile. Brown bears also exhibit this characteristic, but in coastal bears, it is often less pronounced due to their more robust build. If you observe a defined hump on a leaner-looking bear, it is highly probable that you are encountering a grizzly bear. Grizzly bears typically exhibit a more concave or dished facial profile, characterized by shorter, rounder ears. In contrast, brown bears, particularly those inhabiting coastal regions, often possess a flatter or straighter profile and broader faces. The apparent diminutive size of their ears can be attributed to their substantial size, although the shape remains slightly more rounded in grizzlies. Grizzly bears are renowned for their exceptional digging abilities. Their front claws are notably elongated, often measuring between 2 to 4 inches in length, and exhibit a sharp, curved shape. Coastal brown bears, while also possessing long claws, may appear blunter or thicker due to the wear and tear experience from digging in moist, sandy soils situated near rivers. Habitat serves as a pivotal distinguishing factor. Grizzlies are predominantly found in inland regions, encompassing the Rocky Mountains, Yellowstone National Park, and interior Alaska. Their habitats encompass diverse ecosystems, including forests, meadows, and mountainous terrain. In contrast, brown bears inhabit the coastal areas of Alaska, where salmon runs are abundant. In environments characterized by coastal, wet, salmon-rich conditions, encountering a large bear is more likely to be a brown bear rather than a grizzly bear. Grizzlies exhibit a more opportunistic feeding strategy, subsisting on a diet that includes roots, berries, small mammals, and carrion. Their inland diet fosters heightened levels of aggressive food competition. Conversely, brown bears, particularly those residing in coastal regions, have access to nutrient-rich diets such as salmon, which contributes to their reduced confrontational tendencies. Grizzlies also tend to be more solitary, whereas brown bears can tolerate the presence of others during feeding activities, such as at salmon streams. Both species are recognized as protected species within the United States. However, grizzlies face greater vulnerability due to habitat loss and human encroachment. Given that grizzlies frequently reside in proximity to human developments, interactions can become more frequent and potentially hazardous. Familiarizing oneself with the distinctions between these two bear species can significantly enhance wildlife safety and contribute to conservation efforts. If you're captivated by this comprehensive exploration of wildlife, we encourage you to like, comment, and subscribe to our channel. There is an abundance of fascinating information to be discovered about the animal kingdom, and we invite you to join us on this journey.